eight minutes, I will show you a free strategy and a tool you can use to send emails to about 2,000 potential clients free of charge. Very easy. Now, in order to make money in the digital space, you have to have a product and you have to have a client base via which you can send this email to. You need to have your emails. Now, if that is you and you don't even know your customer base and you don't even know how to get this email, that's absolutely no problem. In this video, I'm going to be tackling that. I will show you how you can script emails online. I will show you how you can get your audience online. And of course, Potentially, I'm going to be showing you how you can send emails to them without getting spam, blocked, or getting highlighted. All right, guys, I am convinced you want to learn this. And before we go straight in, I want you to do one thing for me. If this is your first time on my channel, please do very well. Hit the subscribe button, all right? Support your boy, like this video, and hit on the notification button because I do videos like this almost every time. So you'll be among the very first to get notified. And also, liking this video helps this video get in the face of more people who need this video and who needs help with email marketing. All right, without further ado, let's hop in. Let me show you how this works. Now, the very first thing I want you to do is to come on this website called Systemi.io. Systemi.io is a free website that allows you to send about 2,000 free emails every single time without doing anything. All you have to do is to sign up for an account. So you want to come here and click on get my free account to sign up. So like I said, you click on get my free account and it brings you here where you'll be able to create your free account. And all you have to do here is to enter your email, right? So I'm going to enter my email here. And then I'm going to click on get my free account. So you give it some time, it's going to load. And then here, almost there, you need to confirm your email by clicking on the link we've just sent mm -hmm. to your email address. Now, that's very simple. All I have to do is to go on my Gmail and click on the link I was sent from systemy.io. And then I would verify that email. And here I am in my email, right? Very, very easy peasy. I'm on my email currently, so I'm going to click on the email I was sent from systemy.io. So you see what they said, hi, in order to access your systemy.io account, please click on this confirmation link. So I'm gonna click on the confirmation link where it allows me to confirm. So up here, I'm going to put in my new password. So I'm gonna do this, that's my new password. I am not a robot. So I'm gonna save this. And boom, here we are on systemy.io. Now this is what your new, this is what your dashboard is going to look like. Reason being that you have done little to nothing on systemy.io. New lead, zero sales, zero live updates, absolutely nothing. Now if you miss sales or you have new leads, this is clearly where it's going to indicate that. So you see May 14th, May 15th on all of this. So clearly this is exactly how your channel, how your um, dashboard is going to look like. Now hold on, before going on, there is a problem with sending email, which is the bounce rate. That is what we call bounce rate, which means the number of times your email bounces. If your email hits an email, right? Your potential client's email, the number of times this email is not going, is spammed, all right? Now, there is a problem with spam, with bouncing. How that happens is that when you send 10 emails and there is one spam, one email that is being bounced out of it, it automatically means that you have 10% bounce rate. That is how it works. If you have two emails, it means you have 20% bounce rate. Now imagine that you have to send about a thousand emails and then you're having this bounce rate. It's going to automatically block your aunt account. Now, once you have 15% bounce rate, they are going to assume that there is something you're doing that is absolutely not right. And then that's going to lead to like discredit that's going to lead to discrediting of your account and you absolutely do not want that so in order to do this there are ways you can strategies you can follow in order to avoid being bounced and i'm going to show you that you have no worries now the reason why a lot of people have timeless bound bounce rate is because most of the emails you are sending to have not been verified it is very very important that you verify these emails before you send once an email is not verified, because some of those emails are non-existent, all right? So imagine you're sending an email, you're sending emails to an email or to emails that are not verified or emails that are not existing or in existence. And clearly, there's going to be a bounce rate because clearly this email does not exist at all, right? So that's why you need to solve the problem of bounce rate, right? And how you do that is by understanding how you can verify emails. Now, in this channel... I have a video 
that explains to you how you can verify your emails, how you can script emails of potential clients, the exact potential client you need, and how you can verify that. We can't, I can't add that to this this video because it's going to be too bulky. All right, so we're gonna go straight in and we'll continue talking about how we can send this email. But then again, very very importantly, you need to learn how to verify your email. Another problem we need to solve is the problem of CSV file. Now, Systemi.io does not recognize these word files. Now, if you're sending emails through Systemi.io, which is our free email platform, which we're using right now, free email marketing platform, which we're using system, we cannot maximize it because we're using word files. So what is very important is that you transcribe your word file, right, convert it from word to CSV. And that's very simple. All you have to do is to come on this website called Conversio.co. Conversio.co. Now, on Conversio.co, you want to click on choose a file. So, when you click on choose a file, say, let's assume this is our Word document. I'm going to click on this Word document, right? And um, I'm going to press open. All right. So, on Conversio.io, all you have to do here is to come here and click on this arrow and there's going to be a drop down so you have image you have whatever so you're going to click on documents and then you have csv so you click on csv and then here it of course you click on convert hold on it's converting right and then once this document is converted and ready all you have to do next is of course download this email this 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 document so i click on download so we're going to come back to systemi.io. Now on systemi.io, we are not building a funnel. That's not what we're doing. What we're just trying to do is send emails, right? Now the first thing I want us to do is to create tags. Tags are very, very important because that is what categorize what you're sending and who you're sending to. Remember that you can use this same account to send emails to different people for different reasons, right? For someone like me, I have a YouTube channel. I'm into affiliate marketing. I'm used to a number of things, right? I'm, I'm, I'm doing a, long, a, long, a number of things with this website. So clearly, I'm going to have tags for different things I want to do. So if I create a YouTube tutorial and I want to send it to a particular people, it's going to be based on the tags I've created. Now, how do we create this tag? We'll simply come here to contact and we'll click on this drop down. There's a drop down. So you click on tags and then I would add my tags. So all I have to do is to come here and click on create my tags and then let's say YouTube and I'm going to save my tags, tag rather and automatically I have my tag. Now under your tag name you see today zero, yesterday zero, total zero, unsubscribed zero, sales zero, sales per contact zero. I have successfully created a tag and this is how you can create your tag as well. So anyone who I attach to this tag to in my contact, every time I release a YouTube channel, a YouTube video or whatever, um, and I send this email as book, they are going to receive it. So all I have to do is my contact, which is of course your email, you're going to attach this tag to those contact and every time you send a particular number, a particular email, right, specifying YouTube or whatever it is that you do, those are the people that are going to get your email, all right? Now, the next thing we want to do on, on, on systemi.io is to import our contact. Remember that CSV file we converted, that CSV file where it cont contained your emails, right? Of course, so what you just, like I said, all you have to do is to put in the, the list of emails that you've been able to scrape from whatever platform you scrape your emails from and then convert it to CSV, right? So all those emails that you scraped and you've converted to CSV, all you have to do is to come here and import them. Now you're going to come here and click on contact. Now, of course, you don't have no contact, so it's going to be clear. All right, so when you click on contact here, it's going to bring you here. So what you don't want to do is to click, click on import contact. Import new contact. Now look at what they have to say. You're about to import new contact into your account. Beware that you should only import contact who, ha who gave you their permission to send them emails. A high percentage of complaints will get your account blocked. Remember what we spoke about earlier, bounce rate. Before you import contacts, make sure you have cleaned your list of invalid emails. It will be increased, it will increase the deliverability of your emails, right? 
So what you want to do is you want to come here and choose. You remember the CSV file we converted earlier where your contact, all the emails you have are. That's the CSV file we need. So this is it. So we're going to click on this CSV file and upload it. And of course, we only have one tag right now. In the event where we have multiple tags, different channels we send email, um, emails to, it's going to all come down here on this drop down. Remember, I'm using a new account for the sake of teaching you this. So your account, this account will be exactly the same way your account is. So you want to click on YouTube, right? And then that's how this works. All right, so what you want to do next is, of course, you've chosen your file. The next thing you want to do is to come down here and um, click on this drop down. It said, these are the first few rows of your file. Please choose the data, right? So you click on this and you choose email, right? Here, remember, one of the things it says, if you want to add the contact to an existing email campaign, but we're not doing that in this video, of course. So we just do that and come here. Do not forget here, you come here, this drop down and click on email, right? And then you can hit on import. And your contact is ready and good to go. Now the next thing we wanna do is, of course, send our email. So we'll come here and click on newsletter. Oh, I think I did that too fast. Let me try to do that a lot slower so that you can get that. Um, so, so you come here and click this drop down emails, click on newsletter. I'm trying to follow it step by step so we don't miss any step and you don't end up being confused. So what we want to do here is to create, of course. So you see your subject. Your subject in this case is your tag, your tag. Now, a lot of people have complaints that they send email and it ends up as spam. Oftentimes, it's because your, your headline is not catchy enough. To make, so I'm going to use this as my tag, right? To make money online. To make, or rather, let's do this. To make, to make easy and sustainable money online. Watch this video. It has to be catchy. Now, send that name, of course, Financial Freedom TV. All right. Now, send that email. This is very, very, very important. Reason being that it is very important because you cannot use a personal email account. That is why it is very, very important for you to have a domain name. Very, very important. Now, that this might just be the crux of this. You will need a custom domain name. So it's going to be your name, Agono Teofilos Paul, at a particular website. So in this case, I have a website called snowboardshopping.com. So it's going to be at, snow, at show snowboard. Hold on. It's going to be at snowboard.com. So now you can choose between classic editor or visual editor. Now, oftentimes visual editor is usually emails that have pictures, you know, videos and all that. But the, pro the problem is that oftentimes visual editors do not really have good deliverability, right? So you would rather work with classic editor. And classic editor is basically text, nothing more, just text, no image, no videos, nothing. And then now once you've done that, it's going to redirect you straight up to the platform where you have to type your email in and then send. That's about how easy it is to do this. Now, one of the things I want to let you know also is that when you send your email, the reason why I'm not sending is because I do not have an email to send at this time to my contact list, all right? I just created this tutorial for your sake. So you're gonna send the contact. You can schedule your email list for later. You can do it now, you can do it later. But whatever be the case, all you have to do is to type your email, right? From the next dashboard is going to from the next um, page is going to take you to and then you send your email that's about how easy it is and remember i told you you can send 2000 emails every single day 2000 emails every single day and of course you can get free free you can get you can subscribe to this um the free the freemium is zero dollars per month 
the startup is $27 per month, you can upgrade. Now for premium, the freemium, which is the free, of course, you have access to 2,000 emails, 2,000 contacts. But on the startup, you would have 5,000. On webinar, you have 10,000. On unlimited, you have unlimited, which is $97 per month. So you choose what works best for you and then stick to it.